Hey, what's up guys? Penis Customs here. Here's the uh, finished product. Well, it's not the finished product. I still got a little bit of detailing to do to this one. But if you watched my last video, you seen that I was working on a uh, this uh, Chevy. Uh, 62 Custom, I believe. Yes, the 62 Custom. Uh, of course, there's that orange and white one you seen in my last video. And the other one. But here's the uh, the red one. I decided to go with the uh, solid color. I thought it looked nice as a solid color instead of the uh, two tone, like that one. So here it is. Uh, uh, and also in that last video, I showed you that I was gonna make a a. Uh, surfboard and here's the surfboard this is what i ended up with uh pinstriped it kind of gave it a no look you can see that right there old weathered surfboard uh like i said this was a uh a piece for a uh commission piece scd the initials for the uh the guy i'm doing it for all this is hand done by hand this not those aren't decals stickers or anything all done by hand i like it i like the way it came out it's nice in my opinion uh let me know what y'all think about the surfboard pinstriping and all let me know so there's the surfboard put that right there and then here's the chevrolet um Went with the uh, the color is a uh, uh, red with the uh, the by uh, dupla color. And you can see right there. Painted the fog lights, the headlights. Put some black in the uh, in those inserts right there. If the camera can catch it, as well as black in those inserts right there on the bottom on each side. Painted the the signal lights. The headlights, I think I already mentioned that. Uh, painted the trim on the windows. And the trim right there on that side right there. The gas filler tank. But, as you can see, like right there, it's supposed to be more silver. But for some reason, the clear coat kind of faded it. I don't know why. It's the first time it's ever done that. Uh, Chevrolet logo painted on there. The tail lights, reverse lights, uh, everything on this vehicle, on this uh, custom is hand painted. There's the bottom, hand painted. And like I said, like I showed you on my last video, you just learn as you go. Uh, button head screws, and there's the difference. You can tell the, the difference. Button heads versus the uh, being super glued but there's the bottom of it and then uh, there's the initials for the guy that I'm doing this for and yeah you can see it pretty good did the pinstriping the pinstriping is done by hand it's not a sticker it's not a decal it's done by hand uh, it's kind of like a kind of a simple but if you look at it you can kind of see the the details and uh, the interior is a uh, red and white. You can, there you go, you can get a glimpse of the white and how it turns to red. Then also on the, I don't know if it'll catch it, but on the dash, I also put uh, the SCD. It's in there, yes, you can see it barely right there with the right lighting. But it's stuff like that that people like, that I like, you know, that only if you really, really look, you can see it. Uh, rose gray. Of course, you put the, put some real riders on it. But. Overall, I think it came out really sweet. Uh, 
can see them there. Put the surfboard right there next to it. Ready to go surfing. Uh -oh. But like I said, just a few more details, touch-ups, and it'll be done. It'll be ready to go. I really like the surfboard, how it came out. It's got that old look, old weathered look. And there it is, guys. Hope you like it. Maybe I can do a custom piece for y'all. Little wooden base that I made, I made that right there for uh, to display customs, like whenever I want to photograph them or something like that. But there it is. To me, it looks sweet. Uh, let me know what y'all think in the comments. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. God bless.